What? That's right, guys. We are doing a spoke. Okay. Sorry, I forgot about that. The Xbox 360 does that. We're doing a Skyline as far as Adventure playthrough. Uh, never thought I'd be doing this. As you see, uh, I already have one of my save, save slots that I was just doing, you know, before. Obviously, we're going to make a new save slot. I mean, right? Obviously. Uh, no save game. Game progress will not be loaded. Okay, well, I mean, that's not nice. No save game. Game progress will not be loaded. Do I just gotta wait? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I gotta do. I'll just wait for a second. I mean, I'm not really good at all this stuff. I mean, you guys saw, right? Like, at the beginning of the video, or not at the beginning, actually, let me show you how much I need to do to get this to work, okay? Let me show you. Okay, I finally figured it out, by the way. We just gotta do that. It's pretty easy. What? True. Well, I just remember these controls are going to have to get used to. I mean, A is attack now because we're in the first game. Eesh. Still love the game, though. Still love the game. Yep. Yes, sir. You are. So, obviously, guys, you know what we're going to play now. It's like the first ever, the original, the one who started the all. We're playing as Boomer. I mean, Boomer's my favorite Skylander. I, I, I know, you probably thought I was going to play Spire, right? No, I'm going to play as Boomer. Boomer's my favorite Skylander. I mean, sorry, not my favorite Skylander. Favorite Skylander from SSA. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, of course you did. Yes, worship me. So I heard that crack noise. That was my uh, TV. Oh, this is so nostalgic. Just you know, looking back at the very first level. Psh, amazing. So obviously, the first elemental gate is magic. So we'll switch over to Spyro. I mean, all my Skylanders are level well ten in this game, but they're all max leveled. So we don't really need the you know. 100% this level, but it's the first ever level, so we're gonna. Okay, Yon. Snuckles. Snuggles was the first ever mod to talk to us. Interesting. Well, we're not gonna count Hugo and Finn, obviously. So, Snuckles is the first ever one we talked to. Nice. I, I forgot. I think Rizzo. Rizzo, I know um blobbers is in this one i'm pretty sure rizzo doesn't come up until like the troll factory ones though because i know he's like the general of it or something like that now just looking at it like obviously the skyliners have like a lot less health in this game but obviously enemies don't do as much damage as they would normally so so i don't think you can actually go indoors this game like i don't think there's any like house doors you can open oh no rizzo's right there okay i'm an idiot <laughs> Sorry, I've just been an idiot. I, I, I thought Rizzo... Well, Rizzo does become the general of, like, the Mabu Defense Force or whatever, so... Pretty cool. There we go. Now, if you guys don't know, to get the secret treasure, you come back after you do that. Boom. And my controller has ran out of battery. Nice. Now, I don't know if you guys know this, but Xbox One controllers are... I mean, Xbox 360 controllers are very sturdy, so... If I can do it in enough time, I might actually be able to uh, get uh, get away with it and use this control for the rest of the episode. Because if you guys don't know, for some reason, when Xbox 360 controls like run out of battery, at least for me, I can keep using them for like ten, I can keep using them for like ten more minutes if I just hit it, the button again. So uh, yeah, here's the legendary treasure. I have the first ever legendary treasure. Present I present to you the first legendary treasure. It is a weird looking piggy bank. The kids will probably like it though. So there you go. You know, right now I should actually be recording a Faithful 32 lock episode, but I'm not. I'm going to play Skylanders, Spyro's Adventure. 
I was like so amazed like when I actually like set it up. I was like, oh my god, it's actually working. I was like, dang. Cause like I have to have I, I saw uh, like as you saw like I have to have the capture card. I have to have this. I have, to have that. It's crazy. Who's this one? Nort. Okay. A doodle. I don't. <laughs> I mean, I could, but like, I don't know, man. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm gonna try it. Okay. Now, if it gets annoying, I'm gonna not try it anymore, but uh, we're just gonna try to get this up, guys. Come on. We, we got this. I don't want to go because my batteries are all the way upstairs, man. I don't want to have to do that. Nope. I mean, if you say so, I can help you. Boom. Do you need me to push it more forward for you? There you go. Boom, can't jump there, because guess what? If you try to jump, you're an idiot, because you can't. There. I'm going to push you over here so we can go to the magic gate. I'm pretty sure it's Chop Chop Soldier. It's the first one you get, so... Cool factoid. I'm going to put spire on the portal now so i can uh go to the magic gate i mean here we go here's the actual og i know guys i know boomer isn't the actual og but uh yeah there's flintster up there i did i really did i'm not use bounce pads springy and a super springy all right whatever uh, let's go. Um, I mean, look at this. Look at Spyro, the OG. Well, not actually, not the OG Spyro, but the OG Spyro look from Skylanders, you know? Amazing. I don't really know why Spyro fans even bother about, you know, complaining about Skylanders at this point even <laughs> anymore. I mean, they're going to have a new Spyro game this year come out, right? So, I mean, does it really matter? But Spyro fans are pretty stingy. I don't know if you guys know that. I'm a I'm I'm a Spyro fan. Like I like Spyro more than Crash Bandicoot. They're both good games. A lot of Sky Spyro fans are just really nasty to Skylanders fans, and for no apparent reason except because Skylanders used Spyro. I mean, it's kind of dumb, but and it is Chop Chop Soldier that we do get first. So cool. Now I'm gonna keep Spyro until we get to the Tech and Water Gates, because uh yeah. Because I don't know why, like it would have been so much easier if they just put the uh, the magic gate where the tech and water gates have, but no, magic had to be different and hide away down by those turtles. So, whatever. The portal's very under the control of a true portal master. These mystic devices can connect two points in space, dimension, and if we are to believe an ancient legend, even time. See, that's the thing. It actually never tells you what time Skylanders takes place at. So the portal of power could actually, you know, be uh, time travelers because uh, it, it, well, it could like help you time travel because it says it, technically it can. It, well, it said it might be able to. Um, it, might, it said it might be able to, you know, use magic and time. So Skylanders could technically it would take place in the past or in the future. And we're using the portal of power as like a time machine. So that's cool, I guess. I mean, you do need a portal master to time travel, as you guys know from uh, in the in trap team. So, that that good Shattered Island music. Shattered Island has a really good uh, theme. I like it. It's great. It's good. It's epic. Ah oh, yes, the champy, the first ever. Uh, oh, what the? What? That's not fair. You just attacked me. Okay. Uh, yeah, the champy, first ever enemy you do fight. So iconic. I mean, you gotta love the champy. You gotta love it. First ever enemy fight. You can actually, if you want to, like, hate yourself. I'm using it right now. You can use like the, uh, the the sticks. You know, like the uh, the up down right thing. I don't know why you would do that. 
I don't know why, but if you hit yourself, then go ahead and ready for battle. I mean, I know that's how you had to use the other old ones, but all right, let's open this bad boy up. And I guess we'll go into the water gate too because we're using Gil Run Gilly Grunny. Give me all that stuff. Oh yeah, give me all that stuff. There we go. Wait, does going into water regen all your stuff? It does. Oh, I forgot about that. But I don't know why they got rid of swimming. It was so cool. They're like it was fire scan lanterns could also walk on lava. Uh, is that is that all? I forgot if that's all. Uh, elements could do because water skylanders could swim. Fire skylanders could walk on lava. Could any of those skylanders do something cool? I forgot. Uh, I forgot. Probably, and I just forgot because I'm a big stu Oh, life skylanders can make a- I, I think it's only in perilous pastures too. It's so weird. It's like so- I never figured it out until like a year ago that there's a part in perilous pastures where if you have a life skylander right next to it, it grows of just a vine and you can go to get like the ledger. It's so ra it's so weird. It's so random. I don't know why they did that. Like I would have never guessed that on my own, but it, you can do it. So yeah. Let's put big boy boomer back on the thing. The, the thing, the portal of power. Sorry, guys. Alrighty. Well, I am a tech Skylander, so... He does, like, a weird dance. Right? Th that would have been really cool if there was, like, a campaign, you know, for Skylander. Well, this is tech... Okay. Uh, I think we'll be able to get through the episode without getting batteries, but... uh, It would have been cool if there was, like, a... Like, just a part in the story. Like, if they had, like, a quote-unquote campaign... Where like there was a part in the can in, like in the story where Boomer infiltrated like uh, it, it was if it was more like a Call of Duty campaign where like you can switch characters and stuff you know something like that where you could like uh, in like one of the like missions or you I guess you could say was like Boomer is like pretending he's going back like to the troll side like oh yo what's up Boomer you back and like destroying some troll base that would have been cool I think you know boomer deserved way more than he was given he's like is he the only troll sky well i think pop is i think they actually call pop is a troll i forgot if pop is actually a troll or not he might be the only troll sky though so props to boomer for being you know different he just built different you know hops and knee order hops and knee order <laughs> nice Obs and knee goiters. Okay, it's getting a little, getting close to each other. If it does it one more time, it'll play through. Well, actually, since we're right next to the end, guys, I, I think you'll be fine if you just see it come up a little bit more, right? You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Blow that up. Give me the treasure. Okay, come on. Come on, control. You got this. Just one more. You just gotta, like, survive, like, four more seconds. Come on. Come on. You got this. Come on. Come on, hurry. We gotta go fast, gotta go fast, gotta go fast. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Hurry, 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 come on. Control, you got this, you got this, you got this. Come on. Go, go, go. Save, save, save the family, save the family. Boom. You did it. Nice. I don't think we're gonna watch the cutscene right here, but uh, yeah, we did it, guys. We did it. Okay, guys, well, I'm gonna end the episode right here, you know, because it's the end of the chapter, right? There goes the Flinster. Come on, Xbox controller, just stay alive on me. Thank the portals, nice. Yeah, I'm guessing. Ooh! Bow, wow, wow, wow. Chaos, ooh, that guy really grinds my... Can I skip this cutscene? It, it's so weird. They actually never, like, explain the backstory of Cali, I don't think. Uh, at least in the games. <laughs> oh, guys. Yep, this is the start of the Skylander Spyro's Adventure playthrough. Never thought I'd be doing it. Never did. But anyway, guys, if you guys have enjoyed this video of the first video of my Skylander Spyro's Adventure playthrough, 
And thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna go get some batteries. Thank you guys for watching.